we are not proponents of anti-police in terms of in terms of the chance that I hear going on in terms in, ter in regards to in, re in regards to not trusting police we don't condone that because we understand that this was an individual act that obviously the entire an individual act that the entire police department has to take the responsibility for but we understand that cops are necessary I shouldn't call them cops police officers law enforcement is necessary and mandatory and and it's something that we need to change our mindset about the police. And, that's, and that starts with procedural action as opposed to just singling out all the police officers as negative because they're a necessary entity in our society. How would you we, don't, we, don't, we don't think Tony's a saint. We don't think Terrell's a saint. We paint him as a human being, a 19-year-old who made a terrible mistake at one point, which is completely, completely disassociated from this act, which is what I want to make clear. And that's what's very upsetting, that they try to associate his past with this act to paint a picture about the type of kid he was. And I think we can all look back on things we did when we were 19 and thank God that we weren't caught. I trust Wisconsin and the way they're handling the investigation. We spoke to investigators from DCI. We trust them. And we, we trust them to handle this with integrity and to, and to treat it as it comes. We don't want our biases involved. We don't want anybody else's. We want them to act as strictly as fact finders. And that's what they have assured us. And we believe in and we have confidence in that.